October 1st, 2007. This is a big day. I had been planning and just dreaming of a day that I could bring him home for a long time. This is really exciting. When the day finally came in the car on the way there, you know, it just hit me. This is big. After today, things are never going to be the same. And then all of a sudden, I just had this feeling of panic, kind of. I thought, what if I can't decide? I'm a little nervous. But then I got there, and I saw him, and I just knew he was meant to be with me. Whoa! He's fine. And I got him home, and he just fit in so well, you know? It's like he had always been part of my family and he had just been missing. Hey, I'm Bridget, you're watching TV Squad Daily. I swear, there's only like 50 people in Hollywood and they keep swapping and recycling each other for relationships. It's just like dating was in my tiny high school. I think Jake's trying to break up with me. Girl, you are way too good for him. Let him go, he's a loser. I'm gonna ask him to prom. Okay, so you're done with Tyler then? Pamela Anderson is getting married again, and this time is to Rick Salomon. Yes, Paris Hilton's ex. And yes, the video guy. Ugh. The couple was granted a marriage license in Las Vegas this weekend. And believe it or not, there were bigger things going on in the world this weekend other than Pamela Anderson getting another marriage license. Officials in eastern India were dealing with an angry mob and a huge riot. Dozens of cars were set on fire, tear gas was released into the crowd, 12 police officers were injured. And why? Because of something that was said about Indian Idol, India's version of American Idol. The riots were all in response to a comment that was made on a radio show about the most recent winner of Indian Idol. The winner is a citizen of India with Nepalese roots. And Terry Hatcher is going to turn her life into a whole TV series. Geez, I mean, I like her, but who's going to buy that? I don't know who, but somebody already did. A U.S. network already bought the series. And Terry may or may not be planning on playing herself in it. The TV series will cover the same ground as her book, Burnt Toast, which covers her entertainment career and all her many failed relationships. In case that alone doesn't sound super exciting to you, Terry said you can learn something from this TV program. Quote, it shows how to not go down the dark rabbit hole of pain and how to pull yourself out of there. Just put your burnt toast in the dark rabbit hole of pain. But isn't the burnt toast bad for the rabbits? I know, but you're not making sense either. I'll see you tomorrow on the next TV Squad Daily.